So in config about the cross-section annotation like this, so you need to go to two major uh, DGN library to edit it. So in the uh, configuration, organization civils, civil default standard metric, you will have a DGN library, and then you will see there's a call feature definition. Most of the um, annotation group style is that in the feature annotation levels, and the uh, annotation text or the text fields will be stored in the text filter text style dimension, this DGN library. So this is two major important um, DGN library to edit. So let's go to the DGN library first. For, for the uh, annotation group, I just open. So after you open it, you can go to the uh, Explorer, open well or overall standard, expand the standard, go to the features, and then you will see that's called annotation group. So annotation group will also contain plan, profile, and cross section. If you want to edit the profile, you can expand the profiles. Join, you will see there's a one that I just copied this one, and here, I mean, uh, you can even duplicate with it, and then just click manage. You will have a manage annotation, um, one of the manage annotation uh, interface, so you can close it to look at the annotation that you want to set. You can see that any location, titles, so in the title, you will annotate the text size. You can see here is controlled the text size, and the text size will be controlled by another DGN library. And you can control the prop, uh, proposed well level, existing ground level, etc. Of course, you can also like if you don't know where you are controlling, you can just click explain a little bit about this annotation. You will see there's a function called highlight. So if you highlight it, you will highlight which one you are annotating or you are changing. So go back to the cross section. So in cross section, you expand it, join I again. I create one called access frame and create mm. Just right click manage. Again, you can see there's some of the settings that um, you can do. So you can click to have a look. Okay, you can also highlight it and you can change anything you want. Okay, for example, with this one, I have a ground chat level and distance. I go back to the bottoms if I want to add anything new. I can just click add labels, insert label, curvature, or walls. So I just have a subgrade, I just click on subgrade. And it can help me to change here. So in the subgrade, I want to change the text, text size. I go to titles, I can control the box title size. And if these are kind of a text style, and then if you want to go to like the text, you can make sure the box values. So I can go back to the box value. I select the smaller box value here. So we can control it smaller as well. So it is about how to how to control it. And then of course it's a test favorite. I recommend you have a look about what is test favorite because each of the test favorite will contain to a like a text insert field will contain which kind of value they will annotate. So collision and the flame that you can control the size as well. That's all about how we uh, control about the annotation. Afterward, we just click dismiss and save it. Make sure I make click a save settings, and then I recommend you uh, we run all the cross section and new DGN files, and also maybe you turn off the open rail design and we run. It will help you do a lot.